Hi everyone, welcome to the RPP Resonance Chemistry. Now let us continue our lectures on General Organic Chemistry Series, that is a GOC Chemistry Series, lecture number 13. So, which is also a continuation of aromaticity, so that is the lecture number 5 in aromaticity. Now let's go to the topic. So today we are going to deal with the theories of aromaticity. So the theory is frost muslin theory, which is also called as a polygon theory. So based on this polygon theory, who could introduced a, a rule that is regarding to the aromaticity 4n plus 2 pi electronic system 4n plus 2 pi electronic system now let's move on to the topic that is the frost muslin or polygon theory okay so before going to the topic now some points are needed to follow the uh, follows the like a particular polygon theory so those points so first of all or assume all the monocyclic monocyclic molecules are planar let us assume okay now the second one so that molecule in a regular polygon geometry show that the molecule in a regular polygon geometry now the third draw the molecule in a circle so if any molecule is there like a three member ring or four member ring whatever it may be like any any molecule is there so draw the molecule in a circle so definitely draw the molecule in a circle okay now uh, while drawing the molecule in a circle some points are needed some like uh, some restrictions are needed okay now the first one so one of the corner should touches the bottom of the vertical diameter so if circle is there so let us imagine this is the vertical this is the horizontal so bottom of the vertical diameter definitely one of the corner which which should touches the bottom of the vertical uh, like vertical diameter that is the first point now the second point all the corners of a polygon should touches the circle okay and now the remaining corners so two corners are there so these two definitely which which should touches the circuit so this is the diagram which is the diagram of a three member ring like a like a molecule this is the four member ring definitely one of the molecule should touches the bottom so now the remaining one remaining one is like a, it is only possibility for the four member ring okay so this is the rule okay this is the diagram of uh, like frost muslin in a polygon matter now next point so imagine vertical and di uh, horizontal diameter so this is the vertical and the horizontal diameter so after imagine the vertical and the horizontal diameter so those points those touched points of the circles of a polygon okay so let assumed as energy levels here it is one energy level here it is the two energy level assumed as energy levels assumed as energy levels so if any energy level which is uh, directly falls on the like a horizontal diameter horizontal line which is uh, any any energy level which is uh, directly falls on the uh, like a horizontal diameter those are called non-bonding molecular orbital here there is no non-bonding molecular orbital okay so if above the energy above the horizontal plane those are the anti-bonding molecular orbital so below the energy level those are called bonding molecular orbital bonding molecular orbital very simple this is the like a quantum mechanical uh, part of uh, Huckel rules okay now uh, like uh, energy level equal is there then it is a non-bonding molecular orbital above anti-bonding below bonding molecular orbital now here so this is the like a uh, horizontal line so here uh, uh, two energy levels are placed in the like a uh, horizontal line on the horizontal line so these are the non-bonding molecular orbital bonding molecular orbital anti-bonding molecular orbital so this is the another rule okay so after after follows the these four rule the final rule is so if any electrons so if in, not any electrons finally if the electronic configuration of filling the like uh, their energy level that is the lower energy level next higher energy next higher energy like that only okay so if system having the two electrons so two electrons field like this okay now here the configuration is full configuration okay so that is the configuration is closed shell okay now here it is the these configurations are cl closed shell now these type of configurations are present these are the not closed shell okay not closed shell so here it is the closed shell okay if configuration appears like these these type of closed shell so then it is called as aromatic so if not closed shell is there then it is not aromatic so this theory was explained whether it is aromatic or not aromatic it doesn't explain the like anti aromaticity of the monocyclic uh, monocyclic polygons okay simply so this is the monocyclic this theory was useful for the monocyclic systems monocyclic continuation conjugated systems okay or large conjugated systems okay now let's move on to the like uh, rules of uh, this theory let us discuss the some of the examples regarding to the like a frost muslin theory i think it is clear
okay now let's move on to the like uh, some of the examples that is regarding to the like a monocyclic system so first of all we will go through the three membered ring system so three membered ring with cation three membered ring with anion three membered ring with radical okay now uh, according to the frost muslin theory dry a circle one of the bottom corner one of the uh, bottom of the diameter like a uh, vertical diameter should touches the like uh, one of the corner so these are the energy levels okay now uh, second one is uh, all the corners uh, should touches the circuit now let's imagine a uh, vertical diameter so this is the uh, like a horizontal diameter so these are the energy levels one energy level two energy levels so like this is the like an uh, anti uh, like a non bonding non bonding orbital energy level that is the horizontal line horizontal line okay now here there is no horizontal line uh, diagram okay now here three membered ring with cation three membered ring with a uh, like a uh, three membered ring with a uh, radical three member ring with uh, like an anion okay now here it is two electrons three electrons four electrons why because two plus two two plus one two plus zero okay now let us imagine uh, these type of these type of graphs okay these are the energy levels now two electrons electron filling method follows the like their energy level so here two electrons are there two electrons now here three electrons are there so these are the like three electrons third electron jump to the higher energy level so these are the four electrons so if uh, equal energy levels are there after the alpha filled configuration then only pair up takes place that's why here it is the alpha filled configuration okay completely alpha filled now here it is the closed set okay now here two electrons are paired up so here bottom electrons are closed but the top one is not closed so this is the not closed here bottom electrons are closed but the top one top of the two electrons are not closed so not closed are not aromatic not closed are not aromatic not aromatic so here also it is aromatic here it is aromatic so this is the like a four member ring system now the uh, sorry three member ring system now let's move on to the four member ring so this is the circle okay now here four energy levels are there like uh, four energy levels so this is the an imaginary line so two energy levels are anti bonding molecular uh, non bonding molecular orbitals so these are the uh, like anti bonding molecular orbitals bonding molecular orbitals okay now the systems are four like two types so two cations di dication neutral system like dianion dianion now let us imagine the those energy levels okay these are the energy levels so this is the like a regular polygon structure of a four member ring okay now here two electrons are there it is a closed shell four electrons why because two pi two pi bonds means four pi electrons so like here it is four electrons now here it is the six electrons so third fourth fifth electron paid up sixth electron also paid up this is the closed shell so this is the not closed shell so this is the closed shell so closed shells are aromatic so this is the not aromatic so this is the aromatic so these are the like a uh, uh, prediction of uh, monocyclic systems uh, whether it is aromatic or not aromatic now let's move on to the five number ring okay now let's move on to the five member ring system so this is the like a five member ring so all the corners should touches the like a circuit so this way it can only possible so this is the way so this is the like a five member ring okay now here it is the energy level these are the energy levels these are the energy levels so energy levels of the system so now let us imagine like a five member ring with cation five member ring with a radical five member ring with like a anion five member ring with anion now let's move on to the uh, like energy level diagrams so here it is the like these are the energy levels so let us draw the bottom these are the energy levels these are the energy levels okay now here four electrons are there one two third fourth now five electrons are there two three four fifth electrons paired up takes place now six electrons are there so third fourth fifth sixth are paired so here it is the not closed system so here it is the not closed system not closed system so here it is the closed system closed systems are aromatic in nature so here not closed systems are not aromatic so here not closed not aromatic 
So this is the like uh, energy level of for five member ring. Now let's move on to the six member ring. So six member ring is that is nothing but benzene. Okay, now let us draw the diagrams like this. Okay, so this is the diagram of benzene. Okay, now let's imagine like uh, energy levels of the benzene. Like here, so bottom is one one energy level is there. So this is the like a uh, vertical and horizontal energy levels. Okay, now two energy levels are uh, like a uh, like an above the bottom line. Now here another two energy levels. So this is the final one. So that means uh, three pi bonds are there. Three pi bond means uh, six electrons. Three pi bond means six electrons. So one electron, third ele second electron, third fourth. Fifth, sixth electron is there. So these are the energy levels. Okay. Now here it is passes through the like a non-bonding line. So that is a horizontal line. So these two are the bonding molecular orbital. These two are the anti-bonding molecular orbital. So like I think uh, you are aware about uh, quantum mechanics. So here it is the benzene. Benzene having these type of geometry. So those energy levels uh, will like appears like this. So these are the quantum Huckel energy levels, Huckel molecular orbital. Okay, so these are having the like alpha plus two beta energy, like alpha plus beta energy, alpha minus beta energy, alpha minus two beta energy, like this energy. So these are the like alpha are in Coulombic integrals. So beta is the like a resonance integral. So we are discussing these type of concepts in quantum mechanic molecular orbital theory. Okay, so that's all. Uh, this is the like a uh, uh, six member ring system now let's move on to the like a uh, seven member and eight member ring systems okay now let's move on to the seven member and eight member ring systems seven member and eight member ring systems okay now let's move on to the seven member ring system so seven number ring means a tropillion cation. So so here it is the like a diagram like this. Okay. So this is the diagram. Now let's draw the diagram. It is a circle. So these are the two energy levels. Okay, like this. I think I I don't write the uh, like perfect diagram. Okay, now I'll try the once again. So this is the diagram. Now here these are the energy levels. So one energy level, second energy levels, third energy levels, five energy levels. So this is the like a vertical and horizontal uh, and vertical like uh, imaginary diameters. Now here it is the like a tropelium cation. So this is the Three member ring with cation, three member ring with sorry, seven member ring with uh, radical, seven member ring with uh, negative charge. So this is the seven member ring with a negative charge. These are the energy levels. So these are the energy levels. Okay. Now here, six electrons are there, seven electrons are there. Oh, three double bonds are single radical. Now here, three double bonds another uh, negative charge that is the eight electrons. Okay. Now let us uh, fill the electrons. 4th, 5th, 6th. Now here it is clear. So 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th electron. Now here, one first, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th and 8th electron. 7th and 8th electron. Now here completely closed cell. So that's why it is the, like a, it is a very clear, not closed. So here it is also not closed. Okay. So closed system is aromatic in nature. Now here it is not aromatic. Here it is also not aromatic in nature. Okay. Now similarly, let's move on to the like eight member ring system. So eight member ring. So one of the corner definitely should touch as the bottom line. Okay. So this is the one of the corner. Okay. So then so this is the five member ring. Like six, seven. This is the eight member ring. Okay. Now here it is the like this is the eight member ring. Now these are the energy levels. Bottom one energy level. Second, this is the second energy level. So now the third energy level. So this is the fourth energy levels. Now this is the final energy levels. Okay. Now it is the like a mirror image to each other. So the top and bottom. So these are the energy levels. These are the non-bonding, like a bonding molecular orbital, non-bonding molecular orbital, 
anti bonding molecular orbital okay now here eight member ring with a dications eight member ring with dications eight member ring with a neutral eight member ring in neutral eight member ring in negative charge di negative charge okay now these are the like energy levels these are the another energy levels okay now these are the energy levels now here three three pi bonds that means six electrons one two three four five six now here like a seven electrons sorry eight electrons one two three four five six seven eight now here ten electrons one two three four five six seven eight nine ten electrons so here it is the closed shell here it is the not closed shell here it is the closed shell so closed shells are aromatic in nature so not aromatic in nature not aromatic so the here also aromatic in nature so these are the like seven membered and eight membered ring so in similarly like nine membered ring is also present so the nine, those nine membered ring diagram like this okay in similarly extra double bond is there so those extra double bond will shades like this okay so that means uh, here these are the energy levels one two three like four five six seven so these are the like nine membered ring like this uh, okay now nine member 10 member rings are appears okay now let's move on to the final conclusion regarding to the this topic i think it is clear okay now let us uh, summarize the all the things regarding to the like uh, polygon theory okay now here these are the energy levels so here it is the like energy level okay now let us imagine so energy level started with two electrons like this so if energy level having the six electrons then it is also aromatic in nature this is the six electrons now again 10 electrons are also aromatic in nature so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten electrons are also aromatic in nature like similarly like 14 electrons are also aromatic in nature one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen like in similarly another another two energy levels like these are the four fourteen electron levels so here it is the two electrons like six electrons ten electrons like uh, fourteen electrons 18 electrons like this okay so these are the like uh, energy levels uh, with the aromatic compounds okay two electrons that means uh, here it is the like a cyclopropyl tropelium cation six electrons are benzene uh, like a uh, like a uh, cyclopentadienyl anion okay now 10 electrons means uh, this type of structure that is the cycloocta triene dianion like dianion system like 14 pyrene systems so those type of compounds are example okay now let us imagine uh, these uh, like a priority of list okay now here it is the two electrons let us imagine four into zero plus two okay so four electrons there is no four electrons here it is the four electrons zero there is no four electrons only two electrons is present four into zero plus two now here six electrons so here four electrons are there okay four electrons four into only one four electron pair is only one so four into one plus Two electrons these are the two electrons these are the two electrons there is no four electrons four into zero plus two now here one four electron energy level is there four into one into plus two okay now here so four electrons sets are there here it is the two sets so now four into two into four into two plus two okay now here four electron sets are three so that means four into three plus two okay now here four electron sets are four are there so that is called 4 into 4 plus 2, 4 into 4 plus 2. So now 4 into 0 plus 2, that is 2 electrons. 4 into 1 plus 2, 6 electrons. 4 into 2 plus 2, that is 10 electrons, 14 electrons, 18 electrons. This is the like a pattern of Huckel aromaticity. I think uh, all are aware about a uh, 4n plus 2 rule, like a 4n plus 2 pi electronic system, but they don't know why it is 4n plus 2 electronic system. If let us assume your 5n, 5n plus 2 electron system is all, uh, it is possible or not. So here, according to the Huckel molecular orbital theory, so four electron set. So here, there is no four electron set. That's why two electron systems are four into zero. 
here four electrons one pair is there that is a four into one two four electron sets are there two into four four into two plus two okay like we have three sets are there four into three four sets are there four into four so those zero one two three four and so on are integer values integer values so based on this Huckel introduced a theory that is a 4n plus 2 pi electronic system I think all are satisfied this rule okay so this is the based on the polygon rule so those polygons simply it is called as a, like a frost muslin theory frost muslin theory that's all for this video I think it is very helpful and very uh, like a informative informative video regarding to the Huckel aromaticity I think uh, all are aware about 4n plus 2 but they don't know why it is a 4n plus 2 rule okay so this is the major reason uh, regarding to the 4n plus 2 pi electronic system okay so if there is any possible I'll upload the another video regarding to the like aromaticity that is uh, whether uh, like uh, some of the exceptions in aromaticity okay if it is possible I'll upload the like uh, within a week or it takes some more time okay that's all for this video this is regarding to the theories of aromaticity thank you so much for watching